I teach a class which is called Transatlantic Relations, which is primarily on US-European relations post-1945. It's a mandatory class for second-year students, so it's a very big class. And then in the fall, I taught a class on contemporary US history, and the title was Barack Obama's America. He's got a very interesting Italian accent. He's very charismatic as well. Um, he totally manages to get the attention of the class. Um, he mixes, uh, he has PowerPoints in which uh, he includes videos, uh, sounds. It's good when you think back to um, those presidency uh, to have those uh, key ideas. Not only is it interesting because I'm learning about the U.S. foreign relations and the U.S. is obviously an important player today, but um, also there's definitely a lot of concepts and theories and uh, history material that we find in other courses and that help us analyze other issues. The study of history allows or helps to think in complex terms, to get an awareness of the complexity of things. It was interesting because um, I want to study maybe or, or work maybe afterwards in the US, I'm not, I'm not sure still, but um, I really wanted to know more about US history. I did offer to teach a class on US contemporary history because I'm writing a book on Barack Obama's uh, experience uh, in historical perspective. And it was a very useful uh, way of preparing for my book, uh, uh, working on my book, linking research and teaching. I was already interested in the American elections before, but uh, definitely yes, uh, because uh, he told us uh, a few things about uh, modern history. For the moment, I imagine uh, Clinton's victory in the fall, and therefore a, a lot of continuity uh, between the policies of this administration, the Obama administration, and the next one with perhaps a little bit of more interventionism when it comes to foreign policy, when it comes to Syria and the Middle East. I came to a European country to learn international relations and political science as an American, so I was kind of looking for an alternative perspective. Um, I think that's really important um, when pursuing a career in politics, especially international politics. So I thought he was a really credible uh, source of information and a really good professor.